Okay, guys, student government speeches are coming, coming up. Campaigns are coming up. Now, look, a few things about the campaign. Posters. Posters can't be too big. we got to make sure everything's appropriate on the posters. Um, we want this to be a clean campaign, okay? A um, few things about speeches. Speeches need to... Oh, sorry, I'm late. Sorry, I'm late. We're here. We're here for the meeting. We're here for the meeting. Oh, we're doing the same thing. Woo! We're here. Sorry about that. Brady, what are you two doing here? Marie, it's Mr. President, and I'm here to claim my second term, duh. Mr. Tewksbury, do we really need to be here? I mean, I don't know about this guy, but I'm pretty much a professional. I mean, I don't know about myself, but you might need to be here considering what happened last year. Uh, I think you need to be here to learn about keeping some promises. Hashtag slushy machine. All right, everybody, calm down. <clears throat> um, we've had fun with this, uh, but we need to talk to these candidates. Okay, I feel ya. I'm going to work on my speech then. Speech writing is for chumps. I'm gonna go put up some posters. I'm out. That was the moment I knew we lost him. Don't stop campaigning. Hold on to your freedom. Damn the lights. People. Campaigning Hold on to your freedom Damn the lights Keep on Don't stop Campaigning Hold on to your freedom Damn the lights Keep on I'm really worried about Adam and Brady. I don't know what's going on with them. This joke's gone way too far. They just keep campaigning, and I'm going to have to mention it to Mr. Hines because have they forgotten? Have they forgotten that they're seniors and they're not going to be here next year? I'm not really sure what to do. Maybe, maybe they just think they're being funny, or wait a minute. Do they honestly think they're going to be here next year? Do they honestly think they can run for student government again? I'm definitely going to have to talk to Mr. Hines about this. This could be a problem. I have a better question. Why shouldn't I be? I mean, I've given my heart and soul to this place. Like these ingrates here at Oakbrook, I mean, they don't have any belief in me, any faith that I can do this a second time. I mean, who are they? I mean, it's not like stupid Adam Rollins is going to win again or anything. I mean, like, who is that? Two words. Neckbeard. Two more words. Slushy machine. Two words. Pennsylvania. I've called you into my office to have a little talk. I've got to, I've got to be honest with you guys. I mean, look at your shirt, Brady. It says Duke. Adam, you got a Carolina sweatshirt on. Next year, you guys are leaving the mighty halls of Oak Brook. You're not going to be here next year. I love the fact that you still want to be student body president and you still want to run, but we've got to give other people a chance. I'm sorry to have to tell you this, but this is a little intervention here. Mr. Hines, I can do this, though. I promise you I can do this. I've been president all year long. I've done all these things for you. Hey, it was all for Brady, you, Mr. Hines. Here you are. Hey, guess what? Your cap and gown came in today. Aren't you excited? Congratulations, buddy. Gentlemen, look, a 
love the fact that you guys still want to run, but the fact of the matter is we've got some great juniors here at Oak Brook. And, you know, leaders sometimes they need to step aside and let other people lead. So I think I think the juniors are going to do a great job next year, and you guys just got to just gotta give them a shot.